bots are taking over crypto. And in this video, I'm going to show you another instance of how you can use a bot to automate your trading. So already I've been talking about Telegram bots like Unibot or Maestro that can allow you to automatically snipe in or bots like Lootbot that allows you to farm airdrops automatically. And in this video, I'm going to show you PionX. PionX is basically uh, connected with ChatGPT and allows you to build more complex strategies for trading that you can backtest then on TradingView and then connect everything with PionX and trade there. So really cool stuff because PionX connects with other exchanges. So this is the way to actually uh, do trading on centralized exchanges in a very easy way. So let's get started with PionX. Uh, this is the main website. Now, if you go to um, if you go to uh, the um, more and if you click on Pionex GPT, uh, you'll be taken to this screen here. Uh, so you will see that you'll be able to uh, have a bunch of strategies, and you can also uh, get even more strategies if you write something. So, for example, I, I can write something like uh, "Please write me," or maybe I can use "Please write me an Ichimoku strategy." I will have something. Uh, appearing, right? So this is like the standard Ichimoku strategy I'll get. Now, I can also also demand to have to explain this code, but for now, let me show you how it works if I uh, just copy everything here and uh, go directly to TradingView. So you probably know TradingView. Uh, this is the platform with all the indicators, not only crypto, but basically everything. And it's super easy to actually open Pine Editor. Uh, so you have this Pine Editor on the bottom. Uh, you can always close it, but if, if you're looking for that, you can open it here. Now, uh, you paste it here, uh, you add it to the chart here, and then it's compiling at the bottom, and you're going to see uh, the entries and the performance also. So this is really cool stuff because, so for example, this strategy actually gave you, uh, in, the, in the long period of time, uh, this strategy actually uh, is not working because, of course, uh, if you uh, if you shorting, then basically uh, you have bad entry points. But for longing, it looks to be uh, it looks to be okay. So altogether, actually, uh, if you look at the buys and sells, the strategy is giving you net profit of like five hundred thousand percent, five x. So this is pretty pretty cool. And then you can see also uh, the entry points. So even though if you don't want to automate your trading. Uh, then basically uh, you can take this as an indicator for what you can do. So this is one, one thing. And then I can, of course, modify here different stuff. I can also choose, uh, for example, different assets. I'm on Ethereum right now. I can go to like Bitcoin or Solana or anything else that I want to. Now uh, I can modify different things. So going back, for example, to uh, Pionex here, uh, I can say that, hey, uh, modify this strategy to add also, uh, for example, Bollinger, Bollinger Bands, right? Or, or any kind of, uh, any kind of um, thing that, uh, that uh, uh, I want to add, any kind of function. You can also invent something yourself. You can also go to the marketplace. And basically this, uh, this kind of uh, chat GPT will allow you to uh, go through everything here. So uh, this is cool stuff. So this is writing me Bollinger Bands as well uh, for, for, the, for the strategy and giving me the direction. So let's see what happens here. Often also what I've seen is that with more complicated strategies of, or if I try to invent something, uh, the code here is not always working. This will, in this case, it won't be compiling on TradingView. Maybe we'll see that in a moment. Uh, but the idea here is that uh, if it com if it doesn't compile, then you can go actually to ChatGPT and ChatGPT, especially GPT-4, works perfectly, and you'll be able to easily correct the code, even if you're not coding yourself. So as you can see, I, I'm I'm not even looking at the code for now. I'm just looking at uh, I'm just taking everything and want to uh, want to add that to TradingView. So. Uh, this is the the, the, the strategy. Uh, you can see, uh, for example, uh, also uh, how it works. Uh, so the, the bot actually added Bollinger Bands to the existing Ichimoku Cloud strategy. The Bollinger Bands, uh, 
balance are plotted using the length and multiplier. The strategy now generates long and short entries only if the close price is above the upper Bollinger uh, for long entries and b below the, long, uh, the lower Bollinger band for short entries. The rest of the strategy remains the same as before. So it modified and make the strategy a little bit more complicated, uh, but more complex. Uh, so let's see how it works now. I'm going to copy that. Uh, and again, I can delete that here add here and that I can add to the chart. Let's see whether that compiles. Yep. So that doesn't compile. So normally what I would do is I would actually go directly to chat GPT uh, and then talk with chat GPT to modify the co code to make it work. Or the other option is if you don't want to do that, then basically you can also have a look at different strategy. Uh, and what they have is that uh, you can check different kind of uh, different kind of strategies already on the platform. So here you have some kind of a subscription. One of the influencers did a strategy which is very similar, and you can subscribe to that. So basically, that's the that's the idea here. Or alternative version is going to GPT Marketplace, and you'll be able to see uh, a bunch of strategies here as well that you can uh, uh, you can subscribe to. Uh, you have different kind of profit sharing, of course, but Generally speaking, uh, Pionex GPT is really nice for putting out this fine code and then backtesting on trading view is really, really cool. You have all those entries. So if you don't know what to do, uh, the best idea is actually to start with uh, the, the things that they recommend. So creating like Ichimoku Cloud or simple Bollinger Bands or a bunch of other using, you know, uh, TA analysis to, to, to have things like that. Of course, you have to remember that uh, TA uh, technical analysis is not the um, uh, all-knowing tool. You should be, especially on different assets that are much smaller. So you should remember that and not follow blindly whatever the, the bot is saying. And of course, historical results do not indicate that you will get anything in the future. So you should have to you have to remember that as well. Altogether, I really like this option. I really like the strength of bots. Uh, this is so Pionex GPT is another version of a bot. This is cooler. Of course, you have to do a little bit of uh, work yourself thinking what you do but for example if you already have some kind of TA methods that you're using uh, this will this one uh, this might really uh, level up your game and also this back testing then on trading view will really help you out so if you even if you do not call if you don't have like uh, any kind of pine uh, prior pr pine experience when it comes to when it comes to coding this will help you out and you'll be able easily to you know just copy and paste code and maybe then use a little bit of chat gpt uh, to help you out on the way thank you for watching subscribe to the to, to my channel for more i tend to cover all the bots that are appearing i really like this narrative i think also that telegram bot discord bot that will be big uh, as i have said already in my videos on Unibot uh, on my videos on um, airdrop bots as well. And I think there's a plenty of potential in the whole narrative. And the thing with Pionex, this is more um, catering to the people trading on centralized exchanges because you connect then Pionex to either like Binance, Kraken, uh, Maxi, and a bunch of other exchanges. You will have to add API keys if you want to actually trade with Pionex, but it's super, uh, super simple. So uh, if you want to do that, uh, there are tutorials for that and probably I will do a separate video as well how you can connect everything. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.